What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Leaf Green walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we decided to go to some rich people's places and in some cave that got us lost completely. Literally, very, very lost. Like, off screen, I tried finding a rare Pokemon in there. I think it was a Mischievous or a Murkrow. Didn't even bother to do it because it was confusing. Confusing as hell. So, let's move on right here. We're going to be going into Six Island. That's the sixth out of the seventh, and uh, yeah, this will be a two-parter as well. And uh, well, I brought back the majority of my teammates or my uh, my Pokemon teammates here. That way, we can start battling some more Pokemon trainers. Now, here we are in Six Island, and I believe Gary's gonna be inside the Pokemon Center. Yep, he is. That jerk is right here. Hey, Draven, how's your Pokedex feeling up? It looks like it's impossible to get all the Pokemon by hanging around in just these parts. Maybe there are Pokemon we don't know about somewhere far away. Da 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 da. Well, if I can't do it, there's no way you can do it. Get it done too. I'm not going to get all desperate over this. I'll keep collecting Pokemon at my own pace while I train them. That's why I'll do. So there's no point in staying here. I may I may as well leave for home. That's that. Well, that's that then. See you. Smell you later. Flipping you off, buddy. Flipping you off, because I don't like you. Okay. Alrighty, so, let's see. He's talking to me about trading Pokemon. Ten years I've searched the ruins. No, that make that 20 years, and I, I get this feeling that there's something hitting in this island. There probably is. Okay, so, what we're going to be doing here... We're going to be going to the northern section of Six Island. Uh, we're going to be battling quite a few trainers, and then the next episode we will be going down south. That way we can continue on our adventure to the whole Team Rocket thing. There's nothing exciting that young people find exciting here in this island, but this is a good place in terms of nature and history. Relax and enjoy your stay. Okay, well, that is true. That is true. That is so true. Okay, so let us move on right here. Here we are in the water path, and we're going to be battling a buttload of trainers. So many trainers. Nah, I decided to bring a few partners back, so let's go with Tank right here. I've missed you, buddy. Let's go ahead and destroy people. I'm practicing in secret so no one can see me. Alrighty, okay. You can't see anything. So here we go, Juggler Edward would like to battle, and he's coming out with his Voltorb, and I'm coming out with Tank. Oh yes. Rollout attack. Okay, so you guys probably already noticed that I've been uploading a buttload of episodes. Yeah, a buttload of episodes, mainly because of that whole pesky COVID-19 issue. Uh, again, I'm hoping, I'm hoping for, I'm hoping and I'm praying for all you guys out there who might be affected or in, in any such way, whether you have the disease or you have to stay at home just like I do. Yeah, that that right there is a is pretty annoying. Like majority of you who watch the who watch my walkthroughs probably are at school. And all that stuff, and you, you probably take it an extended spring to summer break. It's no fun. I get it. And all that stuff, but you know, hang tight. Eventually, this whole disease thing will pass, and all that stuff. And uh, hopefully, everybody will be, you know, will be in better spirits after this whole thing is done. In my case, in my case, uh, well, you guys already know I am a personal trainer in real life, and that means that I work at a gym. That kind of means that I'm not essential right here, and uh, that pretty much means that I can't work at a gym or in the location because that kind of sucks. You know, that is, from what they said, it is a good cesspool for uh, for diseases and all that stuff. And, uh, well, you know, right now I'm just taking the time to stock up on videos. Hopefully, just hopefully, I finish off Pokemon uh, Black. Uh, in, like a lot quicker than my other Pokemon games. I'm really excited about the walkthrough, mainly because we are one generation close to going into the 3DS, and I'm excited for that one because yeah, I know that game or I know Pokemon X and Y ba like back of my hand, literally like the back of my hand. So I'm excited for that. And then, uh, well, what else is there? Yeah, Pokemon uh, Liquid Crystal. Yes, there's that game too. Now, what convinced me to come out with Pokemon Liquid Crystal? It's this! It's literally this, guys. Um, uh, again, this whole COVID-19 thing has put a pause on a lot of things in our lives. And, <laughs> you know, I just, uh, you know, uh, I'm a little frustrated. 
yeah, I'm frustrated, but you know, I'm also taking the time to just, uh, you know, to to focus on my videos, focus on other things that I have here at home, and then, you know, like I said, eventually, eventually, uh, you know, we'll go back to normal life, and uh, because of this whole, you know, extended break and all that stuff, hopefully I'll have enough videos to just showcase, just upload, right there and then, without, you know, having, uh, having to actually, like, just record them every single week, because that's a, that was my schedule at first, recording uh, walkthrough videos on the weekend, narrating on the, uh, nar narrating the five episodes on the weekend as well, and then coming them out, or coming out with them on, uh, during the weekday, so, there's a positive side to it, kinda, there's somewhat of a positive side to this whole thing, and, uh, oh, crud, getting confused to this whole thing, oh god, uh, here we go, thrash attack. Yeah, buddy, finish him off. That's right. Now, I will try and capture some uh, some interesting Pokemon right here. I just realized that there's a specific Pokemon that I wanted that is only that you can only capture in Fire Red. So that right there is uh, a big down like that. That puts a, uh, a huge damper on my on my like uh, my wish list for what kind of Pokemon I want to have. So we'll see what happens. When we get to the very end of this whole walkthrough right here, we're very close. We just need to finish this whole thing, uh, this whole island thing right here, and then uh, after that, yeah, we'll, we'll we'll see what happens. So here we go, Gyarados coming out, and yeah, he's using that Intimidate. Do I still have rocks? Damn it! Yeah, I don't have it. Crud. Okay, so uh, thrash attack for the win, right? Yeah, buddy. Thrash attack for that win, and uh, well, it didn't do much. Well, it did do much, it's just, uh... It did do much, it's just, it, it didn't make it faint. And here we go with another thrash attack. Yeah, buddy. And that's how it is. Okay, and here we go. Thrasher finally grows to level 58. And, uh, well, Samir has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty. So, there's no more Fisher people here. And, uh, okay, so I do know that these girls want to battle me, so I'm going to be switching out my Pokemon. Let's go with Tank and Thrasher. See what they can do. Uh, she looks at me and she's like, Hello, Pokemon, it's time to play. Okay, alrighty. Bring it. Just bring it. So Mew and Mia want to battle, and they're going to be coming out with their Pikachus. Okay, this could be good. Let's go with an Earthquake attack, and, uh... Eh, for the hell of it, let's just go Hyper Beam. There we go. Earthquake attack, finish him off. That's one Pikachu. Get the other Pikachu. Come on. Oh, crud. It had... It gets tank, but hopefully it won't faint. Don't faint. Yes, it was a critical hit, but it won't faint. That's right. Suck it, Pikachu. Not my Pikachu, though. There we go. And, uh, well, there it is. No more girls right here. Okay, so let's go ahead and heal our Pokemon and, uh, you know, eventually move on right here. Now, eventually we're going to be going into a forest where you're going to be able to find a little bit more Pokemon right here. That's why this episode's going to be a little longer than usual. And, uh, well, let's see. I think you can get a sunstone right here. Hold on. Let me see if this guy is for real. Let's see. My height is 67 inches on the button. I know it is a precisely because... Or, I know it is precisely because my neighbor measured me. Okay. So, that's not the guy. That's not the guy. Okay. Uh, is there a hidden item right here? I, think, I feel like there's a hidden item right here. Somewhere. I don't even know. Okay, uh, we can surf right there. I think that girl would like to battle us, but I'm gonna sneak by. But no, she sees me this dick. I will let a pleasant ble a breeze bleed me all the way here. Okay. Let's go. Okay, here we go. She's gonna be coming out with her sunkern. Now, what kind of ticks me off is that... They decided to come out with some Pokemon that we won't be able to get here. Like, Sunkern is one of those Pokemon. I think it's one of those Pokemon. Maybe. I don't know. I'm looking at the guide right now. Hold on. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm correct. And, uh... Yeah, it kind of... Again, it puts a damper on uh, what I'm trying to do right here. Uh... Maybe, just maybe, I, I, I'll stick with the same team that I have and defeat the whole Pokemon League, or shoot, I don't know. 
But there it is, a Roman lady has been defeated. Yes, you're so cute when you're just so determined. Oh yeah, I am, I am, huh? Okay, so let's see, uh, this person right here, the ultimate horn. If you go to this person right here and bring her a hair cross, she will actually measure the horn. And if you get, if you get a big enough horn, she will actually give you net balls. I think that's what it is. Hair across, big and shiny, big Pokemon. Okay, so that very good Pokemon to actually have right there. So let's see, nothing right there, and uh, nothing right there. I, I kind of feel like there's a hidden item here somewhere. Let's see, nope, nothing right here. Okay, so let's go ahead and use the Surf Attack and uh, grab ourselves that little item that's right there towards the corner. And uh, this one is an elixir. Okay, that's always nice. And uh, let's move up. Let's go up and see what's up. Alright, here we go. No Pokemon attacking me. And, uh, okay, so this is what? The green path, pattern bush ahead. Okay, so here we are. Pattern bush. Kind of looks like the Viridian Forest, and there is a total of... Hold on just a sec. Let me see. Oh crap, there's a buttload of trainers here. There's like, what, 11 trainers here. Yeah, I just counted. Okay, so here we are in the Pattern Bush, and uh, you can actually find uh, quite a few Pokemon right here. One being a Heracross, which is extremely rare. And then you can find Ladybug right here if you're playing Leaf Green. Now, if you're playing Pokemon Fire Red, you'll find Spinrax. And, uh, well, since it's all Fire-type Pokemon, right, or an all-Bug-type, uh, let's go right ahead and use Godzilla and just burn him out of the ground. There we go. I bet you think I can, uh, I'm just some guy, don't you? Eh? No. Okay, so... This looks like a, a chance for me to use that, uh, that speed button right there. I think I'm gonna be using that speed button pretty soon here. So there we go, flamethrower. Yes, buddy, look at that. No more uh, far-fetched. So I'm, I'm gonna try and battle everybody here, but God, it's gonna be it's gonna be a mess, a whole mess. Um, the only the only part that that really sucks is the fact that you can't rebattle these guys. You can't, and it, yeah, it, if you can't rebattle these guys, then yeah. You know, there, there's nothing to do right here. Like, I, I kind of feel like there's some trainers here that you can actually get a lot of experience points from. And, uh, well, let's see. I'm going to switch out my Pokemon. Let's go with Poliswag right here. And uh, let's get the out people from the outer layers right here. Okay, look at me. I got a bug Pokemon that lives only around here. Oh, good for you. Good for you. So here we go. Bug Catcher Garrett wants to battle. And he's coming out with a, a Heracross. Okay. I kind of want to capture a hair cross right now, too. So let's go with Blizzard. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Blizzard. Heracross, a very, very uh, important Pokemon around here. Now, I am tempted in catching one or trying to use one for my team eventually, but... Yeah, Gary's going to have one of those Pokemon, and I just don't want to, like... I don't want to be a... I don't want to use Pokemon that has been like that's being used by other people right here in the Elite Four. Let's see. Um, okay, so she's gonna be looking at us. Let's go and switch out our Pokemon, and let's go with Leah. See what Leah can do right here. Okay, let's go. I'm curious. How do you raise your Pokemon? With love, respect, and a lot, a lot, a lot of battles. That's right, and quite possibly steroids. Oh damn, she. She came out with a Chansey. Okay, so didn't see that one coming. And, uh, well, we're going to have to just, like, chip away right here. Literally chip away with this Pokemon. And, uh, well, it didn't take, didn't take much. So I'm going to have to switch out Pokemon right here. All right, so let's go with Poliswag right here. Okay. Let's see what you got. Egg Bomb. Not effective. So let's go with the... Submission attack. I'm all, I, I'm always so amazed of how like how slow the HP goes down on a Chansey. Eventually, we will be battling a trainer with that has a Blissey. Now, Blissey has a buttload of uh, HP right there, so got to keep that keep, got to keep that in mind right there. And there goes Bethany. Oh yes, with a whole lot of love. Yes, a whole lot of love. Okay, so let's move on right here. Already battled you. I feel like okay. Look at me. 
What's up? I love bug Pokemon. That's why I'm here all I'm here all the time. Am I the only girl that like like that? Maybe. Just maybe. So here we go. Last Joanna wants the battle, and Joanna Man wants the battle right here with their snubble. I think we can find a snubble around here too, right? Could be wrong. I could be wrong. So let's go right ahead and use that Thunderbolt. Yeah, buddy. Get it. And uh, there goes Snubble. Snubble's been defeated, and uh, no more Snubble. Okay, Joanna Man. Get your butt kicked. It's always nice. And, uh, well, let's go ahead and uh, move on forward right here. So, let's go ahead. We're going to try and get through this, because there's a few other things that, the, that we, we can see right here. Of course, I'm going to be battling everybody else out here. Uh, some of them off screen, because, again, there's 11 trainers here. I don't want this to be another Route uh, 30-something or something. I don't even know. So, I'm just going to battle whoever looks at me, like this guy right here. Have you noticed something odd about these parts? Maybe because it has a pattern? Like a bush and all that stuff, maybe? Oh, yeah, it does. Okay, so here we go. We're battling Sand Slash. Okay, so I may have... Yeah, I picked the wrong Pokemon for this one. So let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon here. Let's go to Poliswag. Let's get it. What's up? What's up? And, uh, well, I was assuming it was going to hit me with something pretty... Like with a Ground-type move, but it wasn't. So there it is. Surf Attack. For the win. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, that's how you do it right there. Alrighty, okay. Thrasher has been defeated, or no. Has been experienced points, okay. So let's go right again and take on his Onyx right here. So let's go. Surf attack. And, uh, oh yeah. No more Onyx. Okay, so gonna be coming out with another sand slash so let's go right ahead and stay with the poly swag right here lots and lots of experience points lots and lots of experience points which I will then uh, I will eventually catch up on all of these guys right here so there we go fainted poly swag gets experience points and look at that Layton has been defeated all right let's get the heck out of here okay so don't want to be attacked by any of the Pokemon so we're just gonna be walking through nobody sees us and she sees us. God dang it. Take a deep breath. Isn't the air delicious? Kind of. Maybe. I don't know. If I was there, I would tell you, but I'm not. So here we go. Going up against this last Dahlia. Coming with her hop -ip. And uh, again, don't have the right Pokemon for this. I'm just going to Thunderbolt everybody. Yeah, buddy. Thunderbolt for the win. Look at that. hop -ip. Defeated. Okay, alrighty, and Thrasher finally grows to level 59, and uh, well, let's go get the let's get the appropriate Pokemon for this one right here. So there we go, Charizard, looking all awesome, and uh, here we go with a flamethrower attack. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Finish him. Alrighty, alrighty. And, uh, okay, so what, okay, she's coming out with the skip loom. A lot of these trainers will actually come out with some, like, evolve forms and all that stuff. Pretty cool Pokemon. Pretty cool looking Pokemon. But some of these Pokemon that you won't be able to get. You won't be able to get in the game or anything. You're going to have to, like, trade for them. And, uh, that's one of the biggest, uh, one of the biggest issues for me was that, you know, there was not enough, uh, Johto Pokemon. It kind of feels like Generation 3 Pokemon games missed out completely on that so yeah that's my uh that's kind of my issue right there so there you go skip bloom defeated thrasher kicking some ass yeah buddy okay alrighty so we're going down right here and here we are in the green or out the outskirts of the green path and uh fun fact when I was playing Pokemon Fire Red back when uh you know back when uh, I was like 13 14 15 uh, this is actually the area where I actually found my first Pokemon, my shiny, first shiny Pokemon. And it was a tentacle. I just thought that it was like a glitch. i never really seen a shiny Pokemon in Generation 3. And it happened right here, and I caught it. Now, what sucks about that is that I have, I don't have that Pokemon, uh, Fire Red game anymore. I don't. And, uh, 
Yeah, I kind of, I, I could, I could only imagine what what it would have felt like just to have that Pokemon a little bit longer. So here we are, in the outskirts, and I think she wants to battle us. Yes, huh? I was envisioning my my house, but this is where I teleport. Okay. Okay, so here we go. Psychic Jacqueline would like to battle, and she is coming out with these uh, Zatu Natu kind of Pokemon right here. Alrighty, let's go, Thunderbolt. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Okay, not too defeated, and Aaliyah is still growing, and here comes out a slow bro. So this is a good challenge right here. Alrighty, here we go. Thunderbolt for the win. And that is how you do it right there. <laughs> oh, yes. So what, what, what kind of Pokemon are you coming out with? Okay, it's Kadabra. Kadabra right here. Let's go with Tank. That's right. Alright, Tank. You can do this. Just body slam the crap out of this guy. Okay, so here we go. Body slam. And uh, of course, you're going to be coming out with a Reflect. So here we go. Body slam for the win. And that is how you do it, buddy. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, and oh yeah. Okay, so she just lost right there. Now, is there any interesting things out here? It's just the Altering Cave, and I... Well, I kind of read up that... Oh no, Outcast Island. Or the Altering Cave, I don't know. It's e either or. I believe that the Altering Cave right here, uh, it was supposed to be the place where you would actually find the roaming Pokemon. It, and it's just there now. It's just there because it's there. It was a, uh, I guess it was a missed project or something, or just a, an incomplete project and all that stuff. Uh, actually, correct me if I'm wrong. Just comment down below, guys. Just let me know if, uh, if I'm wrong or not. And, uh, alrighty. Okay, look at that. Defeating the Nicole right there. Kicked your butt. That's right. Okay, so, moving on forward, is there another, oh, god dang, man. What is it with the trainers here? They, they, they just come out out of nowhere. Okay, let's go with Thrasher. I, the goal is to get you to level 60. And if we can't do that, then screw it. Alright, so let's go. Okay, here we go. Let's have a 2 on 2 Marine Banner battle. Alrighty. Okay, so here we go. Sis and Bro, Ava and Jeeb would like to battle, and, uh, well, okay, so they got a Polyworld and a Starmie. Oh, we all know our history with Starmie. We do. Okay, so let's get this thunder on that Starmie because of our, all our hate, and uh, yeah, that's not going to happen. Actually, you know what? Let's go with Thunderbolt onto this guy, and Megahorn onto that guy. And here we go, Thunderbolt. Get it! Yeah, buddy. And that's how you do it. Poliwhirl has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. Okay, here we go with that Megahorn and Starmie. Sucks that you're a psychic type Pokemon. And there you go. Starmie has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. And that's how you do it. Okay. I'm ready. And, uh, okay, so where is this freaking. God dang it! Okay. Like I said, you'll, you'll find these Pokemon trainers out of nowhere. It's it's hilarious. And so, here we go. My Mo wants to battle, and he comes out with his Kingler. Look at this. First time, well, not the first time, but... Yeah, buddy. Okay, you know what? Let's go big. Damn it! Uh, damn it. Okay, so here comes that Stomp attack, and... Uh, come on, Thunder. There we go. Thunder attack. We'll do it. Yeah, buddy. Thunder Attack wins it. Alrighty, and look at that. Leah grows to level 63, becoming just a little bit stronger, and you know what? Let's just destroy. Let's destroy. Here we go. Oh, come on. God damn it. Okay, so let's see, let's see. Come on, Thunderbolt again. Seriously. Oh, God. There we go. One more War Turtle has been defeated right there. Okay, alrighty. So, Maimo has been defeated. If there's another trainer, I swear to God, I'm gonna just I'm gonna go crazy right here. Okay, so nope, nothing. Come on, 
Okay, so there's no trainers here. Oh, damn it. Okay, so you know what? Hopefully sneak by. Here we have a PP up. Pokemon Viagra. And you know what? I'm going to switch out my Pokemon right here. Let's go with Thrasher. And just go, let's go ham on this, okay? So talk to this guy. I'm having no luck at all. A battle could change. Uh, could, could give me a change of pace. Alrighty. Let's get it. Fisherman Tyler would like to battle, and he's coming out with Quillfish, which, ironically enough, you can catch in this version right here. Not my favorite Pokemon, though. So there it is. Earthquake attack. Yeah, buddy. That's right. Still a poison type Pokemon right there, and uh, you're about to grow to level 60, so let's get this. Come on. Here we go. Earthquake attack. For the win. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty. Look at that, look at that. And that is how you do it right there. Tyler, Tylor has been defeated and all that stuff. Okay, so now let's go right ahead and just uh, check out this cave right here. Apparently, again, it was supposed to be the home to the Roman legendary Pokemon that was supposed to be. Are you serious? Damn, how many freaking trainers are there? Okay, well, Thrasher's gonna get the chance to, you know, he's gonna get the chance. There's no rare Pokemon around in these parts, not one. That burns me up, man. I'll take it out on you. Man, damn, damn Team Rocket members. Okay, here we go. Rocket Grunt would like to battle, and he's coming out with his muck. So he's go, he's just going off the like, he's starting off with the best Pokemon right now. Oh, didn't want to use Thrash. Uh oh well, okay all right it's it's doing the, it's doing a good thing, okay. Here we go thrash attack, finish him off and yes Muck has been defeated. Alrighty look at that and well I did say it was gonna grow to level sixty before the end of this episode which is always good, so let's go right ahead and uh, go to Alia. Oh, by the way, uh, Thrasher, welcome to level 60 club. Welcome. <laughs> Alrighty. Alrighty, so here we go. Go big or go home. Thunder attack. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. No more gold bats. Okay, alrighty. So, that is how you do it. And he's going to be coming out with Eradicate. So, let's go ahead and finish this guy off with the perfect Pokemon right here. Okay. Alrighty. Just bring it. Here we go. Flamethrower for the win. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Okay, alrighty. And Godzilla does it. And look at that. Team Rocket Grunt has been defeated. Okay, so why, why are you out here? See, so listen. You haven't seen any rare Pokemon, have you? No, well, maybe. I don't know. Probably. Once or twice, I don't know. Here we are in the Altering Cave. Again, there are no rare Pokemon in here. Um, I think this changes from time to time. There might be a rare item in here. I don't know. If I had a, if I have, if I had an item finder, I would tell you guys. But it is what it is. So, uh, as you can see, you can only find Zubats and Golbats in here, and uh, yeah, that that right there is just, uh, you know, it, it's just. For me, when I found out that this place was supposed to be for a rare legendary Pokemon and nothing came to be, that, that just like, you know, it disappointed me. It really did. Uh, there might be an item here. Something. Should have been right here somewhere. I don't even know. So, let's see. Um, there might be something right here. I'm going to look at the handbook right now. And, uh, yeah, there is literally nothing here. Yeah, literally nothing here. So, yeah. I'm just going to walk away. I'm going to walk away. Alrighty, so let's go right ahead and fly back to Six Island right here. Look at that. We made it all the way up there. So now we are going to go down there and complete our mission. And then complete this whole game right here. Which is true. So, stay tuned guys. In the next episode, we will be going down south of Six Island. And uh, maybe just maybe go to the dotted hole or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Alright? Yeah. I'll see you guys next time.